again. A friendly fan, familiar face. Don't leave me. Oh. Feel pretty. I highly recommend it. I think we can arrange it if you if you'd like. <laughs> You know, we're, I'm so excited to be a part of a film that acknowledges the film, the stunt community and their contribution on some level. It's just, I mean, you could never do it complete justice, but doing it with David Leach, who's a former stuntman, it's just, I've, ever since I was, I, I'm, I started on an action-adventure TV show uh, called Young Hercules, so I've kind of had a stunt double my whole life. And it's always been this strange dynamic where they come in, they do all the cool stuff, and then they go and hide, and you pretend like you did it. And it's not cool, and it's about time, you know, that we sort of recognize that they've been making actors into movie stars for like a century. And so it's so fun to share the spotlight, turn it on them, and just acknowledge that they make some of the most iconic scenes in movies. Some of them, our favorite moments from film in general are, are designed by stunt people, so. It's about time. What can audience expect? Um, it's just a, it's 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 fun and it's uh, you know uh, look if Barbie was a party that everyone was invited to this is the after party that everyone can come to afterwards. It's for everyone. It's uh, really we made it as a love letter to the crew, but we made it for the audience. Just trying. I'm sorry, I keep smacking your okay, your microphone. <laughs> Uh, we made it, uh, you know, just so people could have a great time. And there's just amazing, real stunts in the film, things that haven't been done in a long time. Some uh, records are broken in the film. Uh, it's uh, funny, it's romantic, it's, uh, I love it. I hope people do too. And your co-star over here. Oh my God. She brought the blunt force. <laughs> Had to have it, it was the key ingredient. And you're representing. We're representing, yeah. Thank you. Good. It was like 4th of July. I mean, I'm not even from here, but I felt like I was in a, that was the first parade I've been in. It was amazing. What's it like um, soaking in the atmosphere here? People that come to this festival love movies. Yeah. And they're here to celebrate this. Yeah. I mean, I think it's the least cynical film festival I've ever been to. We premiered Folk, um, Folk, <laughs> we premiered Quiet Place here. And we were so nervous to show the movie to it. I think 10 people had seen the movie before South By, and it, it, it was it blew the doors off the place. It was just amazing and not cynical, in love with movies, as you say, celebrating them. So I think for something as joyful as this film, it's the perfect home. You worked on your share of action movies and done your share of stunts. Sure. Okay. Yeah. Um, proud to be able to um, promote I mean, in every way, yes, it's a celebration of our incredible industry, and this film is about that, but it's really to just broadcast the incredible and indelible work of stunt performers and what they've done for cinema and what they've done for people's entertainment, and they've, they've risked life and limb to give people that crackling sense of wonder that you feel in movies, and it's time they got there outing, you know. As hard as you all worked to make this movie, it sounded like you had an awful lot of time. We did, we did. Like oh, he's the best, he's like a delight, you know. He, it's effortlessly fun working with him and collaborating with him. And I think we were all sad when it was over. It was just like Neverland, it was heaven. Could you please give me three words or phrases to describe the film? Spectacular, sweeping, romantic, right? Your Oscar, your award season wardrobe. Thank you. Spectacular. Well, I had a lot of fun. I, I love oh, it. it. I didn't. I, it's not kidding. Shoes. It was spectacular. I don't think I had. I've had fun. Really good. Oh, fantastic. Thank you. 
Oh, yes. Yes. How exciting is it to be here to show the movie for the first time to audiences with a crowd like this? So exciting. You know, we shot it this time last year in Sydney, start, but starting in like November, October time. So to finally be here, I feel like I've had to keep a lid on it for so long. And my brother and I were obsessed with The Fall Guy when I was little, when I was like 10 years old. So, you know, it's so lovely for me to be able to do this and for him to love it, you know, so, and I've never been to South By. So to come here with this is like doing it in style and then some. And the audience is here truly Absolutely, absolutely, it's, yes. I thought you were offering me snacks just then. It was, <laughs> I was gonna, <laughs> sorry, say again. Yeah, do you know what? Yeah, I don't think you can describe it, and I'm usually quite good with words. It is so old school, completely devoted to, you know, film and TV and music. I feel like I need to come back and soak it up when I'm not this side of the fence as well, because it's really, it's magical. Did you wear your stunt badge on... Uh... I did, but I can't tell you why. I was given uh, an 87 North stunt cap at the end of it, because they were like, yeah, you've brought it, lady. And I have the bruises and the scars to show for it, which I don't mind. They're like, war I mean, they're tiny. You can barely see them, but they're there. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. Well, the audiences, as you know, at South By are historically just the most fun and are here to have a good time and love movies. So this feels like such a perfect movie for this festival, and I can't wait to have a blast in there. What was it like shooting down in Australia with this incredible group of people? Well, it was amazing, and it was also kind of wild. Last year was the year that Everything Everywhere was kind of going on its awards trajectory. So I was doing an award circuit and flying back and forth to Australia for a day. Coming back, I found out I was nominated on the flight back to America from Australia for this film. So this movie has a very special place in my heart just because it was really catching me in, in quite quite a moment. Absolutely amazing. Most of my stuff is with Ryan and I just loved his work since I was a kid and you know he is what I love about him is he is such a ham. He's really hilarious. He's so funny, but he cares so deeply about the story and he was such an amazing protector of this story while being able to have a lot of fun and kick a lot of butt. So it was such a joy to work with him. Did you earn your stunt badge on the movie? I, I maybe I did, I can't tell you yet, but there, there's some stunting that definitely happens. What three words would you use to describe or three phrases? Mm, fun. Like, fun, F-U-H-N, fun, um, steamy, and a good time hyphenated, a real good time hyphenated. That's what, that's a one word, G. Um, yeah, I think it's going to be a, a, a super, super blast, this one. Yeah, thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, my God, you know, there's a strange electricity that's here. Um, I think uh, everyone's very excited. Um, it doesn't feel like, you know, when it comes to Los Angeles, it feels like we see movies every week. We have one of these premieres ever so often, all the time. So um, it gets, there's, there's not as much starstruck. But here, everyone's excited because it's this time of year. It's South by Southwest season. So during this season, it's just like special, you know? Of course. Yeah. Of course. Oh, it comes through in every way. So the main characters, Colt, you know, my character as well. Um, we're all filmmakers and stuntmen, and it's a love letter in the way where you give true depth and breath and focus. You know, when it comes to film, the word focus is a very special word because that's how you give humanity, right? You put the, the character in focus. So by putting the stuntman in the center of the frame, you say, listen to this voice. 
listen to this reality, listen to you know their side of the story, and and what we get to do with with movies is we get to take complicated issues and reduce them into palatable ideas and palatable things you can consume really quickly and easily. And that's what the movie does. It's fun, it's funny. So you don't think that you're learning something. It's not didactic, but at the end of the day, you're gonna go, oh man, I had no idea how these guys worked, and now I'm a little bit more educated. And it's really a shame that your co-stars have no chemistry, no, <laughs> no, no, no. Did I mention they were short? Yeah, they're, they're pretty short people too. It's pretty crazy, yeah. Oh, I loved it. Emily, so we're all pretty much like best friends now, and it's really great. Have a good time tonight. Thank you, absolutely. Thank you. All right, well, we're good, you know. <laughs> well, we want to celebrate stunts, you know, this profession that we're celebrating in the movie. We want to give the audience a little bit of a taste of it here and to see that we were going to be doing practical stunts in the film. Um, and again, the unsung heroes of action movies are these performers, and uh, you're going to see them here tonight. Yeah. It, it, you know, it feels like it. I know it's happening now. We had some real traction with the Academy. There's some right now. We had some traction with the Academy, and it's really happening on the inside now in a really productive way. Um, we got to celebrate stunts on the Oscars, you know, last night, and so um, or a couple nights ago. So it's really um, been um, positive, and I think this movie only shines more of a light on um, that that profession and the unsung heroes of films. We were just, yeah, we were just reminded that we actually showcased Atomic Blonde for the first time exactly seven years ago tonight. This day. So it's really very a very special environment for us, and in fact, that it hits the exact anniversary is pretty insane. Hoping for the same success this time around. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Well, well all, we always have a good time, yeah. don't we? <laughs> and all of that was true, and um, their chemistry is electric, and you're going to see it like people that you want to see again and again and again together, for sure. Yeah. Thank you. Do you thank want you, to go, 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 go. Yeah. 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 Hoping for another one tonight. <laughs> <laughs> so, so uh, for everyone who, who knows the work of mine, Wow. Well, I mean, it's a lot of what you, they still feel the like the people who you've connected to all these times, but they are definitely going through. David a wrote an address. Yeah. Probably on or find my phone app right now. Hi. Hi. How are you? Hi. Good. Uh, we just kind of put on a little bit of a stunt show to display our skills and try to show, you know, what all the cool stuff that this movie has to offer. A bit of an introduction of uh, what's to come. Yeah. I agree. It, it's amazing to have a director that also did it. Um, I was in a situation where I was getting hit by a car for the first time, and I asked the director for a little bit of advice, So, and I've never had that before, which is quite cool. Hey, David, how do you get hit by a car? And then he's like, oh, just do this and this and this, and it's quite a unique experience. Yeah, it helps tremendously to have your director also be a former stuntman, so when, whenever you're doing a stunt, he understands what is going on, what the adrenaline feels like, you know, what, what kind of dangers there are, and all everything that it takes to get it done, so you get a little bit of help from them. And they, and they get it, you know, they, and then they also can capture it the best way possible because they used to do what we do. Did you yeah. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's like once, when, you, when you like action sports and, and you've ever been a stuntman or stuntwoman, you just like doing physical stunts and you like to having fun and doing action sports, so it doesn't go away. <laughs> Uh, 
Uh, lots of things you've never seen before. Um, I mean, it's a movie about stunts, so we did the biggest and the best stunts in this movie. Yeah. There's a couple. In fact, there's more than a couple. So I think you'll have to tune in and have a look. Yeah. Thank, Thank you. you. It's a dream come true. Um, I couldn't be more excited for an audience to see it. Um, very proud of the movie, and I feel very fortunate to be here. And we're and we're here be because of a lot of very very talented people, and it's um, it's a great crew to be a part of. Uh, I haven't had too much time to experience it all yet, but because this movie is a celebration of movies, I can't wait for them to see it and be a part of that celebration. Tell me a little bit about the chemistry between Emily and Ryan and how spectacular they are together. Fire. We saw them at the Academy Awards, and I'm hoping that they will not disappoint. I don't think they will. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. So I'm just excited to put it in front of them and nervous. Can't come out here and say it's a crowd pleaser and then not please the crowd. So um, let's see how we do. Awesome. Absolutely. Thank you. My pleasure.